Hello everybody, you're watching another Essence of Zen video for Python 101 programming. Today we're going to cover a, another graphical package or module that you can install to your Python packages or your library to help you make windows and actual you know, GUIs, graphical user interfaces. I always want to call it graphical user interface I because it sounds more interesting. Anyway. Let's go ahead and get to business. First of all, you need to locate, you know, your Python folder. For some people, you may have it in program files, your uh, normal user file folder. Um, me, I have it right on the local C drive, and because I had to reinstall my OS on this particular computer a while ago, uh, I don't know. I no longer have my Python 2.7, 2.4, so I just have Python 3.3 because I had to reinstall Python on the computer. So I got the most recent package. But, you know, your choice of which version of Python to use, this actually works with uh, 2.7 and no, 2.4 and above, as well as the 3.0 and above. So anyway, now that I have located my Python 3.3, you wanna go ahead and find your library folder, and you want to go down to site packages, right here. And if you open this readme, you can see that this direct directory exists so that third-party packages can be installed here. Read the source for site.py for more details. You ain't gotta worry about the last sentences. All you gotta know is just that this uh, folder location, this directory, is for your third-party packages or modules or you know your your library. It's why it's in li library files. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and go to Google, and you can type in Zelly or Zell, I don't know how to pronounce his name, pythongraphics.py, and you can go to the first one. I'm going to go ahead and not make this so full screen. And what you want to do is you're going to want this file right here, graphics.py. You might want to download the PDF or bookmark this link right here because this is all the information you need for operating the package to make your, your GUI, you know, your window, etc. So, if you want to go ahead and look at the actual source code for the module, you can go here and you can actually look. This is actual code for Python. You have your um, comment section and, and yada 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 and you know whoop blah and howdy howdy ho and all your versions and whatnot. And then you actually get to the actual code for the class of Graphic Win. This is your actual um, window. And basically, he just made it, he made TK Inker easy uh, easier to use. And if you actually look, um, I thought he imported TK. Uh, so you can see he, you know he used actual TK code, and TK is short for you know TK Inker. Enter, excuse me, not Inker. I keep thinking about you know Tinker or Kinker, like you're working on something, but eh. Do, 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 do. Yeah. Hmm. He would have to import something. Import TK. Okay. Yeah. So he did actually import um, TK T, TK enter. So anyway, we're gonna go back here and we're gonna click save link as. And you want to save it in the same file that you found in your library. So find your Python 3.3 uh, library and site site packages, and just save it here. Make sure you have the graphics.py. Got it. It has to have. It has to have the .py. You save that there. All right. Now we're good. So now that we have the actual library, give me one second to bring up my Dropbox off of the screen. Logging in. Okay, so this is a program I made in um, class. It was working on 
this actual same graphical user interface, but in Tom Python 2.4 for the Myro robot or etc. and what whatever. But anyway, just to make sure this works, you can go into your Python to activate the GUI. I'm gonna bring that up here. And then can we do this? No, we can't. What we, what we can do is uh, edit an idle. Alright. And I'll actually make a, another video later on about actual actually making this code and what this code does and about drawing arcs and circles using the same thing. But you, you can see, what, make sure what you want to do is you want to import from graphics everything. So from graphics, import all. Graphics is the .py folder we just downloaded. So after you know you write your code and make your window title and my window equals graph when we saw that on the, one of the the first class within the actual source file but yada 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 to basically I'm going to show you what this actually does I'm going to run it and it, may, it pop off screen but here we are I made a program that made a smiley face isn't it adorable it's adorable look at this smiley face you're being snouted I think next I'm going to make little actual pupils I, I, don't, I don't know but anyway um, this actual program is I'm gonna upload it to my github and I will link it down below in the comments uh, for you guys to play with mess with etc uh, we're gonna have more Python code as well as I'm uh, working on C++ code I'm working on tic-tac-toe for C++ which I had to first start doing Windows and C++ but because I have a class assignment to make tic-tac-toe and python I have to put my Java and my C++ coding on hold to make sure I can get a good grade but that is about all for today I hope this helped if you liked the video please like if you want to see more subscribe tell us what you want our next python uh, video to be uh, remember we're not super awesome programmers we're numb new at this just like hopefully you are if you're watching the video so don't ask for something super crazy but if we can do it or we'll try to do something crazy it doesn't mean we'll actually get it done but hey it's a start hope you guys liked it hope it helped catch you guys later